I was talking to a couple of friends of mine today, and um, you know they have their carry permits too. And we got to talking about spare magazines, and I was really kind of surprised to hear that they do not carry a spare mag. And I must confess, when I first started carrying, I didn't either, because my mindset was like, hey, look, I got, you know, I got ten rounds of forty, that's enough, or twelve rounds of nine, that's enough, or eight rounds of forty-five, I'm good to go. But then it starts to weigh on you a little bit. You start to consider other things. You're know, like, well, what if you know something happened and I needed more? And it always, guys, makes sense to carry a spare magazine. Now, what you carry it in is kind of up to you. But my personal thought is, if you're carrying concealed, you want to conceal that magazine as well. Now, this is like a Black Hawk holster. This is a single stack mag holster. It works great. You know, works for nine, 1911s, probably Browning High Power, some other single stacks. But this is an outside the waistband. Clicks on your belt and it holds it. It's not going to go anywhere. This is what I would consider a range magazine. Okay, Or maybe like in the winter time, if you're going to have a jacket on all day, you can do that. You can wear it on the outside then. I know guys that wear outside the waistband holsters in the winter time because they have a jacket on. Okay, Or some people like to wear a shirt over it or something. I guess that would be okay then. But I generally consider these a range mag. Uh, if I'm going to carry a spare mag, I want it concealed as well. So I use this right here. Now, I bought this at Academy Sports, guys, a couple of months ago. This was like 7 bucks. I mean, it's not real expensive. It's a gun mate, but it's made pretty well. I mean, it works great. You can put, uh, like, this has my XD uh, subcompact magazine in it. Works great. If you see that, you know, if you're, like, in the summertime and you got it on your belt, you're going to think it's probably a knife or maybe a multifunction tool if you're not into guns. Most people aren't going to think that that's a gun magazine, okay? Uh, and you can even put uh, the bigger one in there. Same thing. You're not going to think much of it. You're not going to think much of that unless you really know what you're looking at. Okay, most people won't. They might think it's a phone or something. Uh, and plus, you can also put a single stack in it. It works fine. Carry that. And if worse comes to worse, you wanted to double up. No problem. Carries that too. Okay. So I mean, it'll work. You have a lot of different options. I've seen some people, and I actually used to do this too. I had an old phone case that was similar to this. You know, it had a magnetic pop over it. I, it. It fit one of these magazines fine. Fit a Glock mag fine, especially like a 2.7 mag. Um, and I, I was going to actually have one of those out there as an example, but I couldn't find it anymore. I guess we threw them all away. But um, my theory on it is to conceal carry your magazine as well. Now, like I said, in the winter time, you have jackets, you got different pockets. I've done that before. Or you can throw a magazine in, in like your front pocket of your jeans or your trousers or whatever you're wearing. But um, in my opinion, it just makes sense to carry at least one spare magazine. Okay. Now, I mean, I know guys also that carry like four or five. Um, you know, that's fine and dandy. I think that might be a bit much, but that's me personally. I'm certainly not going to tell them no. Because as Mr. Knorr said in one of his videos, when I'm going to try to say his channel name, I'll screw it up. Uh, I wish I didn't have any more ammo, said no one, whenever they were in a firefight. So um, it just makes sense to carry. So do you guys carry a spare magazine? That's my question to you. If you do, what? If you've got some other ideas on how to conceal carry it, pop them in. I know there's a guy I saw it, a video. Uh, he had gone to Lowe's and bought a knife, and the knife... Uh, holster that he had that clips onto his belt carried a uh, Glock magazine perfect so he don't even use his knife he uses it for, uh, for a spare mag and it was like I think the knife was 10 bucks and it came with that so there you go and you can buy these that are very similar to this like I said I bought this at Academy for about $7 I think Blackhawk makes one very similar you can buy it at Walmart for like $9 okay so uh, they're not very expensive and, and uh, I think these work pretty good that's just my personal opinion but anyway, guys, that's all I got. I'm going to leave you with e Bombie's theme song, and I will talk to y'all later. I feel pretty, oh so pretty. I feel pretty and witty and gay, and I pity any girl who's in me today.